So it's really important for businesses to consider their carbon footprint and to calculate it because without knowing the impact that you're having across different parts of your business and your supply chain, it's very hard to know what steps to take to reduce the impact that you're having on the climate. So in terms of measuring our carbon footprint, we've actually just started to embark on that journey. Um, previously, it's been a little more ad hoc, and when someone's had a great idea, we've enthusiastically gone with it. Um, and now it's about um, consolidating and aims and targets. So we worked out our carbon footprint by using the BIA, which is the B Corp Impact Assessment. And I think what it did for us as a small company is it gave us a really good framework to understand what we needed to look at, what we needed to measure, and how we went about measuring that. Because none of us are trained in sustainability. We're ultimately running an office supplies company. And I think the B Corp Impact Assessment will be a great tool and a great framework for anyone wanting to start this journey. It's complicated. Uh, there's an awful lot of factors involved. You know, when I think about the big, the big elements of, of emissions in farming, you've got large amounts of, of emissions associated with fertiliser. Yeah. Cattle, they do emit methane. The amount of methane they emit varies quite considerably on what they eat. On the other hand, you know, we're growing grass and grass is taking carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere through the wonder of photosynthesis and sticking quite a lot of it back into the ground as glucose. When I look at the big, uh, big elements to attack, the fertiliser seems to be the first place to go. It can feel quite overwhelming and complicated. It's a data gathering exercise, essentially. But increasingly, there's tools coming online which break it down into different scopes, one, two, and three, and explain what this terminology means and give you a leg up into inputting the data that's going to give you an accurate measurement of your carbon footprint. we're going to procure you know, online software to help us, because it is complicated. It's not something that you can just click your fingers and, and get done, but it's important to show uh, the ongoing gains. We uh, joined Green Tourism a few years ago, quite a few years ago, and one of the good things about joining an organisation like that is that they have carbon calculators and they can help, they're a go-to resource, so uh, if you don't quite know what you're doing, you can go to them and say, look, you know, this is what we're doing, and they'll help sort of guide you through all this. Once you've done that, it's like the, the clouds lift and you can actually see what your business is doing, which is damaging the environment. And of course, that's the whole point here. You can then set a target, work towards it, track it, and most importantly, communicate how you're doing against it.